Good morning, everybody. It's Brian here with Premier Buildings Nebraska. Today, I wanted to do a fun video for you guys and kind of walk you through our website. Um, lots of neat things going on. I know we're kind of slowing down this year and people are moving more towards uh, Christmas and all of that, but you guys, right now is a great time to save on a shed. Uh, if, if you've even been interested in it, right now with the 20% off, it's lowering the monthly payments. It's lowering the amount of taxes you have to pay. It's, it's lowering a lot of different things. So it's not just the price of the building. Um, but I do want to go through this here with you guys uh, so that when you are wanting to utilize our website and maybe build your own building or get a hold of us, uh, you know how to do that. So I'm going to share the screen here right now. All right. So. Well, it doesn't look like I'm doing it. Let's see here if we can try it again. All right, there we go. All right, so on our website here, this is premierbuildingsnebraska.com, okay? And we're going to kind of walk through this here a little bit quick. Right here up front, you can see, you guys, we have a huge sale going on, like I mentioned before, 20% off on all of the buildings till the end of November. Um, I'm going to take a quick moment here for a really short apology. You guys, we have no control over what Premier does and we don't know what they're going to do, okay? Um, I wish that we were allowed to go back and give people, you know, that bought earlier this month, uh, the, they got the 10% discount. I wish we could do the 20% discount. Premier as a company doesn't allow us to do that. We are, we are a dealer. Um, so if you think of it as like Ford versus uh, your local Ford dealership, your local Ford dealership doesn't know what the rebates are going to be. Ford just drops them and we can't go back and do anything to, to change the paperwork, right? There's a lot of different things involved there and, and we just can't. We are super empathetic. I know when I bought my building, I, I didn't get a discount. And then all of a sudden Premier dropped a 5% sale. And I could have saved some money there, but it's just the breaks. And, and so I'm very empathetic, I'm very sympathetic, but there's just, it's out of our hands. Um, I wish we could do what, I wish we could just, you know, wave a wand and do that for everybody, but we can't. So, but we are going to give away two smokeless solo stove bonfires um, this month. So last month we gave away the chainsaws. Um, so I know... Uh, Mr. Rollins, and Mr. Tyler are both super excited about that. Um, and we are doing those. So up here on our page, this is our menu up here. So we do have our brochure and pricing. So one of the things that I really like about Premier and why I bought a Premier building before I was a dealer was because of how transparent their pricing was. You know, you can go down here and select the state you're in. And then oh, look at that. I got two pages the same open up. So we'll go here to the brochure page. And you can look at the size of the buildings and see how much they are. Now, you guys, these sizes here are our standard sizes. So you can see like here on this lofted barn cabin, I'm going to blow this up a little bit. You know, we jump from a 12 by 24 to a 12 by 32. Well, if you want maybe a 12 by 28, we can do that. Okay, just reach out and let us know. Um, just keep in mind in Nebraska, the 12 wide and the 16 wide are not true. Uh, they're measured eave to eave versus wall to wall. Um, so that was one thing I, I learned with my building. Okay, so Nebraska lot inventory, you guys, we have all of our lots on here. Um, Omaha, Eastern Nebraska sales, that's something that will be utilized a little bit more here later on. We're working on a couple different things. Uh, we're also working on moving a little bit south of me. I know we're, we're picking up some other locations here, which is going to be a lot of fun. Um, but you can click like right here on my Hampton lot. Let's take a look at that. You can see in stock, here's our brochure, but I have two buildings in stock right now that are not sold. Um, buildings, you guys have been going nuts. Uh, I started mid-July. I, I thought that this would be kind of a cool, fun side job, and it is uh, really turning out to be the main gig. So, you know, that's why we pick up the phone when you call. Grant and I treat this as our, our primary business, and, you know, this is what we want to do.
we love selling these buildings. We believe in the quality of the product and we're, we're here and excited to help you. Now, one thing here, guys, you can see this is a used 12 by 24 lofted garage, okay? Um, this building is $9,800 or was $9,800. Well, the original price is $10,895. So even with the 10% discount, you could buy a brand new one with warranty for the same price this one was. Well, now Premier is running a 20% sale. So I've got to use one here that was 9,800 or you could buy a new one for 8,700. Um, so I talked to the rental company about that a little bit and we agreed to lower the price on this one to $8,000, you guys. Um, so this is a great buy now on a 12 by 24 garage for $8,000, okay? Um, the design tool. Uh, if you don't see a building on our lot that you're absolutely in love with and you have a different idea on what to do, you can click here on the design tool and it'll take you right to the shed view configurator where you can design your own. Okay, so <clears throat> like this is a really cool little 10 by 12 lofted front barn. Okay, well, pretty standard here with our 70 inch double door, but let's say we want to remove that. And let's say we want to, there we go. Now we've got a little garage door on it. So now it's our little golf cart cabin out at the golf course. And then of course you can change the colors on it. Uh, maybe, maybe your home is more of a slate blue and we wanna do some gray trim and a gray roof on it. Um, some different things like that. Maybe your house is white and you wanna give it a pop with some blue trim and a blue roof. You know, whatever it is you wanna do, we can do that. Now, a really cool building uh, that I've been able to build a couple of here uh, recently is with our lofted barn cabin. You guys, I love our lofted barn cabin. Um, to me, out of all the cabins, it's kind of the best bang for your buck. Um, so what we did on these is we did a 12 by 32. Well, I did one 12 by 32, one 12 by 36. Okay. So we'll look at the 12 by 36. So on this one here, like if you don't like the window right there in the middle, you want one up here and you wanna grab another window, we can put another window here. If you wanna double stack them, it'll tell you when they can be there, okay? And now it's you kinda of got a cool window. Now we can do another window. Maybe we wanna go back here with the next one, okay? And you can see height-wise, those are all lined up by those red, red lights. Okay, and then back here, we added a roll-up garage door. Now, if you're gonna add a roll-up garage door and the building is wider than 10 feet, I highly recommend you go to the nine by seven versus the six by seven, okay? It's only $50 more and it makes life a lot easier getting your toys in and out. Okay, so what we've done on this building here now is we built a combination she shed man cave. <laughs> so you no longer have to fight or worry about getting two buildings. We built two of them into one. Okay. So they're going to put a wall down here where he can put his, all of his yard tools and workbench and all of that stuff back here. And then the front part is going to be kind of her she shed or a playhouse for the grandkids. Um, so there's lots of cool things we can do there. Uh, another really cool building we just did was a side lofted barn like this. Uh, but we added another door. Oops, don't do it there. Right here, we added a door. Okay, and we did, it was actually what we did is as we custom built a, a Dutch door that went in right here. So the top can open and the bottom can stay closed. And what these folks are going to do, it's a little bit bigger than this. It's a 10 by 20, if I remember right. And what we're gonna do with this is this little four foot section over here underneath the loft will be a playhouse for the grandkids. And the other 16 feet will be storage for grandpa and grandma. So there's no end on what we can do um, for buildings for everybody. I mean, you want a Dutch door, let me know. Um, we've, we've now done a Dutch door. Those are pretty cool. Uh, if you want, uh, spray and foam insulation underneath here. That's not an option on here. Like Grant and I know we can do that. If you want a metal building up here where all the styles are, you can click over here to metal and now you can choose colors for your metal. 
Um, and I don't know why you guys, I love this blue. I do. I want a blue with a gray and a gray here. Uh, I just think that that looks really, really sharp. I love this building. Um, probably our most popular building uh, that we've had here on my lot to date uh, was a black building with a charcoal roof and charcoal trim. Uh, and you can also see once you go to metal, you go automatically to dual fiberglass doors. Uh, you guys, the fiberglass doors do seal a little bit better than our normal 70 inch doors. Um, but if you're going to put like a garage door on here, just put mouse traps or bait traps inside of here. Okay. Um, I would love to tell you that they're mouse proof. Maybe you're better at uh, sealing things up than I am. But with my garage door, I've had a couple mice in my garage. I've already trapped them, killed them. Uh, been out there every week now for the last three weeks and haven't, haven't seen any more, but you know, different things like that. Um, but you guys, there's no end what we can do with these buildings. Uh, if you do like the, like, let's say the cabin styles here, but you want the entryway over here on the left, let Grant and I know we can do that for you. Um, and Chase, sorry. Uh, we have a new, new gentleman joining us, uh, joining our family business. Chase, uh, I don't know if it's Brian or Brian is his last name. Um, he uh, is joining us and we're super excited to have him. Uh, so we will be uh, introducing Chase to a lot of you here shortly. Um, but yeah, all sorts of things we can do build on site. So let's say you have a really narrow opening. We can do build on site. Uh, the one thing I like letting everybody know though, is if once you click this build on site, it jumps the price about 30%. So here you can see the price on this one is $62.95. We do a build on site, it automatically jumps a couple thousand dollars. So that's one thing to keep in mind. Uh, let's say, you know, you want a garage and, you know, we want these doors and windows on the other side. Well, we can just remove them here. flip over here and we can do the doors and windows here. Okay, now on the garages, they come standard with a little bit bigger window. They come standard with the three by threes. Um, if you want dual pane windows, we can do dual pane, but those are only available on the two by threes. And you gotta let us know because um, there's obviously not an option here for dual pane. Um, Grant, Chase and I will always try to do a pretty good job, though, of asking what you're going to use it for, because uh, if you're using it as a she shed or a workshop or something like that, we know you're probably going to heat it. And so you're probably going to want, um, you know, dual pane windows. OK, so here we are. We just switched the door there. Now the door is centered between those two windows. And let's say this is how you want your building. OK, so then what you do is you come down here and you just hit submit for quote, okay? Now, one thing that will happen is Premier here will tell you your total estimate. So here's the price of the building and any options that you have included down here will adjust this here, okay? So, but right now they don't show you what that 20% discount is. So if you submit for a quote here, you can put in your information. Uh, comments here are maybe, would like to know discounted price, okay? And then you can put, I am working with a dealer right here and you can put Premier Buildings Nebraska. Uh, you can put Grant, you can put Brian, you can put Chase, um, whoever you wanna do here and Premier will actually send us that link for you so you don't have to worry about sending it directly to us, okay? Um, if there are any other questions you guys have though, or anything else that we can help you with, please let us know. Uh, we will be more than happy to help. Uh, once again, you know, I'm Brian. Uh, my phone number is 308-380-3948. Uh, my cousin Grant, his number is 402-340-0538, I believe. And then Chase, his number, he must be from Virginia or something. Uh, his number is 804-310-8210. But just give us a holler. Let us know what we can do to help. We're a small family-run business, and, and we love the, the individual relationships we've built with all of our customers, and, and we look forward to building with one, one with you, too. So from everybody here at Premier Buildings Nebraska, thank you for watching, and we'll talk to you soon. Bye-bye.